Touchdown confirmed. Three years after NASA's InSight lander touched down on Mars, it has delivered the information that it was sent to collect from millions of miles away. This is definitely the data that, that we've been waiting decades for. For the first time, scientists have mapped the interior of another rocky planet. They discovered a thinner than expected crust, and the biggest surprise, a larger, lighter, and more liquid core than earlier estimates. For comparison, Earth's core is much more dense, meaning the Martian core is at least partially made of different elements. Why is this important? Why should Earthlings care about the composition of Mars? It allows us to uh, take our theories of the formation of rocky planets in general, and the Earth in particular, and understand how the, our planet formed out of the initial solar nebula, how it changed from just kind of a ball of kind of gray, indistinguishable meteoritic material to the diverse planet we have today with oceans and continents. On Earth, there are earthquakes, but on Mars, they're called Marsquakes. The InSight lander's cutting-edge seismometer spent two years measuring them and tracking those seismic waves as they rippled through the red planet, while NASA's other active robot is focused on the surface. The Perseverance rover is expected to collect its first Martian rock any day now, but for the first time in history, NASA has company. In May, China became only the second country in the world to successfully land a rover on Mars. NASA Administrator Bill Nelson testified to Congress that the images beamed back from the Jurong rover should be a wake-up call. We're suddenly realizing that we don't own all of this, and it is uh, a very aggressive competitor. Kristen Fisher, CNN, Washington.